Hey guys, and welcome to Minecraft Tornado Survival, Season 5, Episode 4. And unfortunately, the storm did not save. Like, I, I quickly back on right after I recorded the video. So, yeah, right after I recorded the video, I completely um, logged out of Minecraft and then logged back in, and the storm over there was gone. So, yeah, unfortunately, we don't get to see what that would have turned into, but we have a fresh new start as far as storms go. So... Yeah. Um, this episode... This episode, um, I'm not sure what I want to do. Maybe we'll go do some exploring in the caves. Probably won't stay in there too long. And maybe we'll expand the house, too. And yeah. I'm gonna start cooking some food right now. So yeah. Um, oops, didn't mean to do that. We're not going to go to the caves right now, because as you can see, the sun is going down, so. Yeah. I'm going to start cooking that. And let's go to bed. Look at that beautiful sunset. nice sleeping and watching the beautiful sunset okay so I'm gonna make I'm gonna wait to make a bunch of iron armor until later but for now I'll make this I'll make more armor later Actually, I think I can make boots right now. Or a helmet. Or even pants. Yes. I can make leggings. There we go. I actually used up all the iron. But that's okay, because we'll go mining this episode. We're gonna explore the caves. There's a cat. Um, are these the caves? These, I don't think these are the caves. Why is the cat? I'm just gonna check this out real quick. See if it goes anywhere. Here are the caves that we explored. So I'm gonna make a waypoint right here. This is the cave entrance. Um, color will be gray. Icon will be. I guess I'll do a pickaxe. It's the cave entrance. So my goal is to be back up by night. Is that a ravine? Looks like it. I hear roaring. 
there are a lot of places to be explored in this cave. Look at this, there are so many places to be explored. I'm gonna get some of this coal because we're starting to run kind of low on coal, so we actually do need some coal. I think this episode, I'm going to explore the ravine, and then in future episodes, I'm gonna explore the other tunnels. It's pretty good having a cave system near the house so that we don't have to start a strip mine, at least not for now. Eventually, we're going to explore the whole cave system and we'll have to start a strip mine, but it will be some time before that has to happen because this does look like a pretty nice cave system. some iron underneath. We do need some more iron because I used all my iron for tools and armor. Um, hopefully we find gold and redstone too because we're going to need that to make weather items. Eventually, I'm going to want a radar. That would actually be a really nice thing to have, is a radar, so that can track the storms and see where exactly they are. Look at this ravine. I'm going to try to make a stairway down. I'm gonna try to make a stairway down the ravine. It's not gonna be an easy task, but we should be able to do it. And I know there's iron back there. I'll probably get it later. There's quite a bit of iron. And this ravine opens up to the outside, so. Yeah, that's pretty interesting. Let me get the iron right here. Probably not gonna get all of the iron that I just saw right now, but I'm gonna get some of it. I'm gonna get the iron that I pass by. It's just that. I've got some over here. I'm gonna keep making the staircase down. I wanna get to the bottom of this ravine. There we go. Need a staircase. So I'm gonna put, ooh. Don't mess with me, Zombo. What the heck? I see something over there. I'm just gonna put a square of torches right here to mark where I go up. 
I'm not dealing with that right now. Unless it comes to me, then I have to deal with it. But if I don't have to deal with it, I'm not going to. For now, I'm just going to line over here and that thing can do whatever it wants to do, I guess. There's plenty of iron. elevator to different levels of the ravine. It's starting to get dark. I'm actually going to start heading back now, because it's starting to get dark. We will explore this area more in future episodes and mine more of the ores, but for now it's probably a good idea to start heading back. So this is where my staircase was. Don't want it to be dark for too long. Otherwise, mobs are gonna spawn like crazy. Um, trying to find the exact way up here. easy to get along. Yeah, you guys, I am lost in these caves. Some of you guys might be screaming at me to go a certain way, because you remember which way I need to go, but... I do not remember which way I need to go. So yeah, I am sorry. <laughs> I don't remember at all. And 
And you guys, if you hear meowing in the background, that's just my cat. So yeah. It's not in the game. Well, some of it might be in the game, but some of it might actually be my cat in real life. So yeah. Uh, what was that? Your thunder. Gotcha. I don't know what exactly that was. It looked like some sort of wolf. I hear thunder. If a storm forms, then I'm this time I'm gonna stay for it and see what it develops into. Like I might just pause the video and wait for it to develop. Because yeah, like it's almost time to end the episode, but at the same time, I do not want to reset the storms again. So I think the best compromise here is to just pause the video. If something forms. Or to pause the video until something forms. So yeah. Cook some of my food. I hear a lot of mobs. I should just kill those mobs. I'm just gonna kill those mobs. Let's see. Is that zombie gonna come out of the water? Yeah, mobs in this version are stupid. They think it's okay to come out of the water when it's broad daylight. I hear thunder, but I don't see any storms. Where is a storm? Come on, come on. Come at me. Come at me. I don't think it was necessary for me to dive all the way down there for rotten flesh, but oh well. Where is the storm? Like, I can hear thunder, but I do not see any storms. Okay, you guys, I'm gonna pause the video and give it like a few minutes and see if anything happens. I will be back. So, bye. I'll pause the video. Alright, you guys. I gave it a few minutes. And I see rapidly rotating clouds in the distance. So, let's see. What is this? You know what? We're gonna go on a little boat chase. This is about the time that I would usually end the episode, but... I'm going to make this episode a few minutes longer because I want us to get some action in. Like, storms keep forming at the very end of episodes, and I want to get some action in, so we're going to extend this episode a little longer.
than usual at normal time. So let's actually get a bit closer. It looks like we have an F0 tornado over there. Let's see, where is it going? Is it lifting? It looks like it's lifting. Wow. <laughs> I just found this tornado and now it's lifting. Well, at least we saw it. Yeah, at least we saw it. I might actually raise the frequency of storms a little bit. Just so that storms don't keep forming at the very end of episodes. Because, yeah, that's a problem. But, yeah. Unfortunately, the tornado did, like, lift right when we got to it. But at least we saw the last bit of it. I don't know how strong that tornado got. We'll never know how strong it got. My guess is that it was always just an F-Zero, but I could be wrong. It could have been stronger at some point. We'll never know. But, yeah. Let's go back home. I will... Um, I will actually um, increase the... I will actually make it so that storms are a little bit more frequent. So that um, storms don't keep forming at the very end of episodes. But it's still going to be less often than half a day. So anyways, I'm going to end the episode here. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I apologize if there was any lag audio issues or any other inconveniences during the video. And we will see you guys next time. Goodbye.